Hi, welcome to Tech Talk. My name is Andy. And my name is Tony. Today we'd like to talk to you about um, the different um, data options through Verizon, uh, the different devices and, and what it does for you and how you access uh, internet through these devices. Um, the first one I'm going to talk about is our USB um, modems. Uh, what this little guy does is it, it plugs into a USB port in either your laptop or desktop and provides uh, internet access to that device. Uh, the advantages for this one would be, especially when I think of these, I think of a desktop um, because a desktop normally isn't Wi-Fi capable. So then what this would do is this would just pop out and plug into your, your desktop. Uh, it would provide a 4G, uh, in, if you have a 4G signal in your area, this provides a very fast um, connection to the web. And the second option I'd like to talk about uh, is the Jetpack. Um, now this guy is geared towards wireless devices. Um, so any tablet you have, a laptop, a desktop, if it is wireless capable, um, you know, those nooks, those type of things too. Um, what this does is this is battery powered, so it comes with a battery that you charge up. Uh, you turn it on and this transmits a wireless signal that your devices connect to, just like a home internet source or at the hotels or anything like that. Um, on a 4G network, this will support up to 10 devices at one time. Um, it's very mobile, uh, so you could have a laptop with you in the car on the trip, turn this on, and as long as it has a Verizon signal, which is pretty much everywhere, uh, you've got internet connection to your, to your uh, laptop. Again, it's a 4G device, so it's very fast. Um, very handy little device, easy to use, easy to connect to. Um, very useful. Mm -hmm. That they are, yeah. Uh, so those are the kind of the dedicated internet devices that we have for different options. Um, we also have uh, smartphones. Um, you know, not only can you connect to the internet using your smartphone and you know surf the web, everything like that, um, but all the smartphones that we carry, whether they're Android or Apple, uh, have a hotspot built in it. So basically, like Andy was showing you, this jetpack. Um, the, the smartphones have that hotspot built in, so you can share your internet connection with those other devices, your tablet or your iPods or Wii's, things like that. Um, and it's very easy, there's a, an app in there that you can click on, you turn it on, you enter a password on your wireless device that you want to connect, very similar to connecting your, your uh, wireless router at home. Mm -hmm. um, so you can use your smartphone to share that internet con connection. Um, also, uh, all the tablets that we carry, um, besides being Verizon uh, compatible like your smartphone, so you can surf the web using Verizon here, they also have that hotspot built into them. So you can turn that connection on on your tablet, same as your smartphone, you can share that um, that Wi-Fi connection through your tablet with those other devices also. So uh, many different options as far as portabilities. There's advantages to both. Uh, there might be disadvantages to both. Um, like the options that I covered, the disadvantage there would be, you know, your device is your internet connection. So mm -hmm. if your smartphone, your tablet, say, leaves your house, you basically took your internet connection with you and now you don't have one at home, where those others would be more of a, you know, at-home solution plus have that mobile benefit also. Yeah. Um, so, you know, there's four different options there. Um, we do also have, uh, you know, more of a, a, a permanent option, I guess, um, at home. And if you want to run through that real quick here. Yeah, if you're out there in an area where, um, like if Arvid can't provide landline cable or you can't get CenturyLink out there, um, your only option is, you know, dial up or maybe a satellite internet service. Uh, Verizon came out with um, what they call home fusion. Uh, the antenna is this actual size, so it's not real large. It gets mounted on your house, and then through the 4G network, this provides internet to your home. Um, so this is a great alternative to that satellite internet, that dial up. Um, also, there's larger data amounts um, that, that you can consume for a little less than if you were to go with just a jetpack. Um, so a little heavier data, data users would use this, um, as well as if you're you know, out there where you can't get landline internet options. Uh, it's very fast, um, super convenient, uh, professionally installed. You don't have to worry about installing anything. They come, they make sure they hook it up for you. Um, make sure that the wireless is working. So, very good option. Yeah, so we, we covered a few options. Uh, if you do have any questions, you know, feel free to stop by any of our locations. Uh, we can test drive some of those devices with you and uh, kind of figure out what fits your needs.